Boy, we can go across to James Andre standing by. James, what's going on where you are? Well, the, uh, this, is, uh, this is one of Paris's main convention centers. Uh, it is known as the Palais uh, de... Uh, le, le, uh, sorry, excuse me. It's one of France's main uh, congress centers. Uh, this is home to the main agriculture fair, for example, in France, and it has been turned into a massive vaccine grown. In all, there are 20 lines for people to come and get vaccinated. The objective is to vaccinate 2,000 people uh, every day here, and it's part of an effort to ramp up vaccination. Now, indeed, Emmanuel Macron with Gérald Darmanin and Olivier Véran are expected here uh, for a formal inauguration. The point for the president is to show that he is on every front to make sure the French get as many doses as possible. At this stage, six, uh, a little more over 16 million people have had their first dose of vaccine here in France. Around 7 million have had both doses, that is around 10% of the population, and that, of course, is trailing the likes of the UK, where uh, nearly double the, the amount, of, uh, over double the amount of people have had their two doses of vaccines, that's over 20% of the population, and the United States, which has reached 30%. What the government here is proposing is that they want to vaccinate 20 million French people to get them their first dose before the 15th of May date at which vaccination will be open to less than 50-year-olds, and then I'll have to wait till the 15th of June uh, for all adults over 18 to be able to get vaccines here in France. So, indeed, a big effort to ramp things up, and centres like this should multiply all over the country. James, thank you very much for that. James Andre, they're reporting uh, the French government continues to resist calls to open up vaccinations to all adults.